mass flow sensor calibration. We should be doing this ideally from different crops, different varieties. If we're collecting harvest yield data out the back of the machine, a thousand litres of beans weighs a lot more than a thousand litres of rape, for example. So we calibrate that up according to the crop. Okay, so I'm just going to talk you through that. So this is the screen we want to be on, the combine main screen. If you're unsure how to get there, press the menu button in the bottom right hand corner. I'll look combine, get through. So what we're looking to do is the spanner button here. Press him. Calibrations, a drop down menu, different calibrations here. Normal harvesting conditions, enter. If you know the calibration factor and you've been that crop before, even you can manually input it just there. But the majority of the time, people will do it automatically. So we want to just click the next step button here. Okay, so what we're looking to achieve is press next. And we need to make sure the grain tank is empty. Prior to starting the yield calibration room. So what we need to do, this is going to measure a quantity going into the grain tank. And when we've got press put that quantity in there, we'll unload the whole amount. For example, so if we do a full tank, we unload the whole tank. And then that amount then needs to go over a weigh bridge and be weighed. And then we input into this screen and it knows for example, that 10,000 litres of grain harvested is equivalent to 8,000 kilos. And then off the back of that, it can produce accurate yield maps. Okay. Some of this may be a little bit limited because I'm not harvesting crop today. So if I click next, this is as we're harvesting. So harvested weight. So this is what it's indicating it thinks it is. So as you keep going up here, it's more weight. The next step won't work because I haven't actually harvested anything. But in the field, you would harvest up to a weight, unload that whole amount, get that weighed, and then input that weight in here. And then it will give you an accurate indication then of your yield map.